Hey YouTube, I'm sitting in the car with my kids and I mentioned yesterday that uh, when we take trips, my boys actually contribute to um, figuring out the finances, figuring out how much it will cost, and actually contributing their own money to part of the trip. So if we have a trip that is gonna cost a couple thousand dollars, um, like let's say a trip to Disneyland is gonna cost $5,000, um, that's just an estimate so far that I got from a travel agent, and my boys will come up with 2,500 of that. So today, I thought I would take you with take you with us. We are gonna try something new. We've never done this before. They have done pet sitting, and pooper scooping, and cleaning, and garage sales, and cookie sales and stuff but they have never done this before we are looking into a little bit of the um, fulfillment by Amazon so we have decided that we are going to take um, a little bit of money and go buy some stuff and see if we can resell it on Amazon so we are not professionals this is not advice on how to do that I just thought um, you guys might like to see that this is like just a quick little business idea um, if we do uh, make a profit then they will pay you back um, and if we don't then it's a learning experience for all of us so anyway um, here we go we're off to a okay so we we have arrived at what was supposed to be a huge book sale and apparently we got a little bit like um, duped. It might not be a bad experience but um, like they said look for the U-Hauls. Well we get here and the U-Hauls are a big, it's actually a place where they rent U-Hauls. They led me to believe that you um, that you would buy the books that it was just U-Hauls full of books and it's actually an indoor flea market. So we're gonna still go check it out so I'll let you know. Okay well we're back out and yeah that was a total waste except we had, we learned what a pachinko machine is and we learned about, um, we le I guess it's like a Japanese slot machine and they had one there. So we learned what that was. So we're gonna chalk it up to an educational experience and I think I'm gonna have to learn how to discern the ads on Craigslist. So it's been like 45 minutes because we had this big bathroom detour and yeah, that was mainly because of me. And um, we are stopping at a garage sale and I don't know if we're just having, if we got a late start or if we're just having a rough day, <laughs> we might need to go back to bake sales because so far this has not been super easy and it's not something that we're planning on building a huge business, but just we'd like to just sell a couple things. So we'll see. We're at a garage sale and I'll let you know. Okay, so we ended up getting um, this set of books at the at a garage sale and a lot of them we're actually going to use for our homeschool. Um, and then and then probably sell them but then a lot of them I think are are probably some good things for us so hopefully I will let you know we spent a total of ten dollars and I will let you know if we made a major score and if it okay, works out so not. we just left a garage sale <laughs> and uh, they had no books they had nothing and they had only girl clothes and we got this um, but we did get this sled what do I you think I never took pictures of my kids Look at what them. Do I um, so we got this sled hands? that is supposed to be super fast and yeah that wasn't really but we got it for a really cheap deal um, although it didn't make us any money <laughs> All right, so we're gonna we're gonna look for another garage. Sale. Okay, so at our garage sale, we bought this cool little thing that holds the phone, so we can drive while videoing. So my boys wanted to jam while we were driving. So you are on the fastest route. Jacob refuses to jam. Jeffrey, you're gonna have to lean in a little bit. Okay, so I am driving with my new thing. I hope this doesn't turn out to be a dangerous thing, but it's kind of cool because I can talk to the camera while I'm driving. Oh, and you're probably getting my directions too. Yeah, I'm lost. So anyway, we're going to our kids a thrift store here in town, and it's probably the last place we're gonna go before we go home. Sorry about the directions. And get ready to uh, go swimming. So uh, we're gonna do some cleaning too. But all right, here we go. So my boys are digging through their find. We ended up not going to the ark. We're going to Goodwill. So we'll see how that works out. Yeah, we've spent hours. We have a ton of fun thrifting and. Actually, since we started RVing, it has changed um, just the way we do so many things. Everything is just, I think I keep using this word, but intentional. Everything is intentional and amazing. So um, I will do a video on that and um, how living in an RV has made us much more fearless um, in the future. But for now, we're gonna take you to Goodwill. So we decided to go ahead and go to Goodwill instead of ARC. And here we are and doing the, um, 
we're making our way back to the books. My super thrilled kids, because but first we're gonna go to the bathroom and we make um, many bucks. And they, and they um, and my uh, always having to go to the bathroom drives them all crazy. So as you can see, we are nowhere near books. So we're back from Goodwill and um, and from our various garage sales. And the boys are starting to look through the stuff and they're going to get ready to um, start labeling it. We know that some stuff is just, um, you know, we're going to just, it's a loss, but some stuff will be this great. Um, <laughs> great. My nine year old's looking at I hunt for killers. Anyway, we, um, we know that some stuff is probably going to be pretty valuable. Just we used an app and looked at it and my boys also Play bought a bunch of, Lord of the Rings. stuff to build Play stuff out of. Yeah, we've got the Lord of the Rings, the whole set. And so we are going to give this a try. We spent a total of $16. So um, I know you have to spend some. I'm an orange guy. I love Yes, so I know you have to spend some. So hopefully this will help to pay for their Disney trip. So I will do a video. Um, in a week or two and let you guys know how it worked out so i hope you enjoyed this video and please subscribe um or like or dislike i guess and uh, <laughs> yes, yes like is a thumbs up dislike is a thumbs down and just subscribe love you guys i know this was kind of a silly video i hope it turns out to be awesome and i'll talk to you soon